To find the number of atoms in KNO3, that's potassium nitrate, let's first write down the elements. So we have the potassium, that's K, nitrogen, N, and then the oxygen atom. So these are the elements in KNO3. For potassium, there's nothing written after the K, so we assume the subscript to be one. So there's one potassium atom. Same for nitrogen, just subscript of one if it's not written there. And then oxygen, the subscript is three, so we have three oxygen atoms. If you want to figure out the total number of atoms in KNO3, three plus one, that's four, plus one is five. So there's five total atoms in potassium nitrate. Sometimes you're asked to figure out the number of, say, oxygen atoms in one mole of potassium nitrate. In that case, you would take the number of oxygen atoms, multiply that by Avogadro's number. So three times Avogadro's number, that gives you the number of atoms of oxygen in one mole of KNO3. If you wanted to figure out the number of nitrogen atoms in one mole of KNO3, that would just be Avogadro's number, because you only have one nitrogen atom. This is Dr. B with the number of atoms in potassium nitrate. And thanks for watching.